YouTube sweeties, welcome back again for the next and hopefully seventh run in the Eden Streak video. Um, in the Eden Streaks on YouTube, sorry. Um, I'm not going to spoil last run for you if you haven't seen it, but if you're here watching this one, um, I'm sorry you now know that the streak has made it to seven, um, <laughs> or to six, I guess, and hopefully seven. Um, go ahead and watch the last one. I really, I really suggest it. Um, I will have that one highlighted at the end of this video for you guys to see. It's, it's, I, I called it the glow up challenge for a reason. And I think you'll really, really enjoy it. I do. I do. So yeah. Anyway, with that out of the way, we're going to get back into our run again, because as per usual, um, I'm not going to introduce myself here. But yeah, so there's the win streak. It's at six. Here's Eden. Let's go. Boom, boom, boom. All right. Damage is okay. Shot speed's okay. Tears are all right. We have explosive -o. I actually really like explosive -o. Um, it's damage when you need damage. You just gotta be careful. The good thing is that it grows like that, so it's really easy to tell when you, um, you know, need to back away. Are you a wizard is annoying, but it's fine. We're gonna take the justice card with us. Um, so for those of you who don't know, we do try and keep the channel, um, educational for those of you who maybe don't have as much experience with Isaac as some of the rest of us. But, um, the reverse justice card can drop between, I think, two and four golden chests. So it can be really versatile, especially if you find yourself a way to re-roll, um, to get a re-roll machine or whatever the case may be. You could spawn this in a secret room and go for something really cool. Um, item room, whatever, whichever room you have, angel deal, devil deal if that's more your style. You know what I mean? So... That is what the Reverse Justice card does. We're gonna save it until we have at least four extra keys. Our health, I forgot to mention, we don't have any deal protection, but at least it's two hearts and not a single heart start. Um, all right, so what I also have, our active is called Metronu, and it gives you a random passive for um, as long as you are in that room. So we got Sci-Fly in here, which was cool, and prior to that we got Science Shots, which is also really cool, so. So far, Metronome has been popping off. You love to see it. I, would, I wouldn't use it in like an empty room, it's kind of pointless, unless you get really lucky with Terra or something. Um, I like to use it here, like in a room where there's fights, because then you get this. What is this? Is this the... It is! So it can even give you a passive from Devil Deals. Interesting! I didn't actually know that. I don't use Metronome a lot by choice because it is so RNG based and it could be a lot of different things. Speed down is not good. We're already slow. Lissai. <sighs> also, I haven't really thought yet about what this YouTube video's discussion question is going to be. So that's an oopsies on my part. So we'll figure something out before the end of the run. <laughs> before the end of the run. Um, so if you hear me go quiet here and there. Expect it to be because I'm just thinking. <laughs> or yawning, because what just happened there was a yawn. We're gonna bomb here. <clears throat> Unlucky. Unlucky as heck. I was hoping to get at least something good. Um, pain. I could have used the bomb here and maybe brought the card generator for hopefully reverse judgment card, which could have been used you know, with the reverse justice card. But we'll see. Maybe we get a bomb from this drop. Oh, it's this guy again. Um, if you plan to watch 
the last Eden Streak video and haven't yet mute your mic for a second so I don't spoil anything, but we had to fight this guy in our last video, our last streak, and we almost died to him. It was terrifying. So it's just really unfortunate that we got him <laughs> again, but it's okay. We're just gonna move right along. We do have four keys, but we're gonna need two for next floor if we plan to see the shop and the item room. So we'll see how things play out. We will see how things play out. Uh, I didn't see what this was. Oh, bless. Bless. I was afraid I was gonna get blown up. Scary. Oh, oh. I think this is Zodiac? Unless that was the cross that's giving me this? If you don't know what the Celtic cross is, by the way, it just has a chance to, uh, spawn a shield when you're taking damage, which can be really nice. Alright. I thought we'd at least get a crawl space, no? Sad. Sad. It's fine. It's fine. These guys are the easy ones. You just stand in the cardinal directions to them. And you can shoot right at them. Easy peasy. Not a problem. Not a care in the world. Alright. Judas's shadow. Interesting. So I wonder if I were to die here, if I would become Judas. I'm not going to even test it, to be honest, because it's a little scary. And Judas, Dark Judas or whatever is who you would be, um, can't even get soul hearts. So, or can't get red health. They can only have soul health. So, it's a little scary. Not gonna lie. Not really something I want to do. Realistically, actually, let's try in. Let's try in a... Darn, I wanted to try and get him to blow this up a little bit more. Ideally, right here, so I could get the keys, but that's okay. We're gonna use, we're gonna check this out. This room never is worth it, <gasps> but we got bombs. So, actually worth it. Because we can do this here to get both keys, and do this here to get the chest and the key. So we actually profit. We still end up with, like, no bombs, but it's fine. I honestly shouldn't be opening these red chests either. You know? Jumper cables. I don't think they're gonna proc here. So far, so good on terms of, like, not taking damage on the second floor. Which is good because we just have the one soul heart for deal protect. We're gonna let these guys blow up next to each other. Darn. Nice. I don't even think we found the item room yet. Oh, come here. They're not gonna because they're afraid of me. Well, we got one of them. We got one of them with our Cuba meat. Doop. There we go. Item room? Nope. Did we get the item room yet? No, we have not. These these little poop friends can be dangerous because it's like, look how very minuscule the different is bet the difference is between which one of these are your friends and which one of these are yours. I mean, I get it's actually a pretty big difference if you're used to it, but, like, I wasn't paying attention for a second there, and I was like, bruh, what? Bruh, what? This way? No, then up here in this way. As per, as of recently, we're going to be trying to do fast, faster runs. trying to get away from the hour long you know 
Can you just like quit being a little crazy crackhead, bro? There we go. We're good. Up is shop. Please don't touch me. Please don't touch me. Please don't touch me. Please don't touch me. Nice. We're good. I'm gonna put out these fires in case of like one extra sense. That would make it worth checking out this shop. And I should be looking for secret rooms because if I can find a secret room with a reroll machine, we could be in business. That may be all we need. And now just because this card will spawn us, um, ooh, that's birthright. <gasps> we need a bomb. So just because this card will spawn us some gold chests does not mean that they will give us items. But there's always a chance. There's always a chance. You know? So, what's in here? I would have actually taken a, uh, a bomb, a bomb item for this one. I would, I would. We might actually have to open these chests um, to look for a bomb. We'll see what happens after we get this boss fight out of the way. We're gonna ignore the devil deal. I don't know what that, I think that was dad's note. I'm not certain. We're gonna do some editing to check that out I think. We'll insert it after this boss fight. Or maybe like right now. I don't know. Okay. We take this. This is good. This is good. Let's see. Do you have a bomb? I don't think so. Nope. But you do have a scent. But that's not enough. We need a bomb. Alright. That being said. We're gonna go all the way to the shop. We're gonna drop these chests down, because that way, even if we don't get a bomb, we may get a troll bomb. Okay, good. It's not a reroll machine. So we're gonna drop this literally right here. We only got two. Oh, bless bombs. Okay. And you? Alright, some extra money as well. This is good. So we're gonna bomb right here. We're gonna bomb our right machine. We're gonna bomb this beggar. I'm gonna get a bunch of money. <laughs> We're going to grab birthright. You may be asking how I know this is birthright. My cool items mod is having an issue with my like personalized birthrights mod. So here, let me show you real quick. Um, so you can change which mods are active as long as you leave a mod on. So I am going to shut off. Where is it? I'm going to shut off Rebirth Items Vectorized, and we're going to go back. Huh. Maybe if I walk out and walk back in. So it just really doesn't like it. Okay, never mind. But let me prove to you. <laughs> let me prove to you. That that is birthright. Okay. Da, 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 See, told you. All right. Anyway, we'll get our item first. Ooh, ooh. This is tough because like that's like one piece guppy. But then we're gonna end up with like no keys, and we kind of got debated last time with guppy. So I think I'm gonna take Cricket's body. It's so good. It's a tears up and in the tears they just like explode everywhere. All right, I'm gonna go turn on the cool items mod. I actually wanna try one more thing. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm so, so, so sorry. Turn the unique birthrights back. It's not gonna matter. I just realized it's not gonna matter because we already bought birthrights, so. We'll leave unique birthrights on and we'll turn our sweet bean mod back on. Looking in the past videos will find will show you um, where you can find those mods. Should you choose to look them up, they are there for you. Okay. We're good to go now. We're good to go now. We got Lucky Foot. 
Lockfoot, sorry. I know some of you are like, it's Lockfoot, Bane! And that's fine, but <laughs> I call it Lucky Foot. I think it's better payouts from gambling and stuff, and also pills are good, so. You like good pills. You like good pills. All right, piercing shots are cool. Piercing shots are cool. More of a chance that our explosive shots will hit as well, if you can't tell. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Don't lose the angel deal. Bane, please. Oh, my gosh. We need help. What is this? Luck up. Okay. It's something. Do you have a heart? A lot of times, sacrifice rooms will have a heart, so... Keep your eyes peeled, whether it be a red heart or a soul heart, it usually, or even a half a heart. A lot of them will have um, hearts. Sorry if I take a minute to focus, you guys, but these guys will kill me if they hit me. They do do an entire heart of damage. So it's very a uh, panicky moment. I need a speed up, like desperately. <laughs> Okay, we're doing okay. We're all right. Our range is still pretty bad. Very nice. Give us a heart. <gasps> Bless! All right, we did lose our angel deal chance, but that's okay. All right, what do we got? What do we got? All right. We'll take this. And we'll check the item room. Check the item room. This is actually really good. Leech will carry. Leech has carried me before. Leech is amazing. I love Leech and we stand Leech. Every every chance we get, we stand Leech. Right? Oh, bless. Like right now, Leech is gonna carry us. And help us. And heal us. Which is the most important part. We're so slow, but there is our, um, there is our Celtic Cross, by the way. Also, we got Sin Hearts, I think, from Pact. I did not know that using this gives you the health that is attached to an item if it, like, just gets added on. So that's really cool. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm amazed and grateful. <laughs> so very grateful. Ooh, we'll take this. We don't spawn any flies yet. If you guys are wondering what the heck this trinket is, it doubles your fly or insect spawn. So let's say I have, I don't know, a box of spiders. It'll double the amount of spiders that box of spiders makes. Um, if I have Guppy Head, it will double the amount of flies that Guppy Head produces. You have jar of flies and it's full instead of 15 flies you'll make 30 i believe is how that works as well so this room used to be really annoying to me and then i like just learned to take a fucking chill pill <laughs> i think that was coupon i think that was coupon no because coupon's inactive i don't know what that item was I don't know what that is. The secret room here. There we go. Ooh, we love this secret room. I've said it before and I'll say it again. We just don't love when it bites back at us. That's painful. All right. Boom, boom. We'll move this one down here. Bombs. Okay, item. Darn. We do get a health container, though. I'll take a health container. And I'll take an Eternal. The Eternal is the health container. Sorry, I should clarify. We increase our Angel Deal chance by a teensy, teensy little bit. Teensy, teensy little bit. We still have to find a shop. The shop could have something good for us. It could, it could. It's, it's a possibility. All right. The good thing about our leech is our leech does not die. Our leech stays with us the entire time. We love our leech. I would not sacrifice our leech. If we can find a BFF in this shop, I will take it. I didn't even see what that was. What the heck? 
What do you got for me? Another bomb? Another scent. Let's see. What do we have? <sighs> mm. That is so freaking tempting, but so freaking dangerous. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. Metronome's kind of been a carry. What is this? Death? This doesn't really help us much. This is tempting. <coughs> Pardon me. Sorry. Taking a drink of water. <sighs> Hopefully we don't regret this. We're gonna take this first though and then we're gonna take this. All right, let's go. Don't regret this, Bean. How many hearts are in here? One singular heart. Okay. Yes, we blew her up. We didn't get the angel deal, that's okay. We'll be healthy. The more heart containers, the better since we have our good friend Leech. All right, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Don't second guess it. So if you guys don't know what Alabaster Box is, if you have not taken an Angel Deal um, and you have the Alabaster Box, you need six soul hearts to completely fill it. And once it's full, you use it. You'll get two Angel Deal items and three soul hearts, if I'm not mistaken. It's not nearly as good or worth it unless you have a bunch of extra health on the ground if you've taken a Devil Deal, though. If you've taken a devil deal, I think it gives you one angel deal item and maybe less soul hearts. Either way, it just doesn't seem like a risk to take. If I had gone devil deals here, I would not be taking this risk. Um, because it wouldn't be profitable for me. But since I have not taken an, a devil deal yet, we should be okay. Go, leech, go. Go, leech, go. All right, this guy is fine. Ah, oh, will you open your face? Nice. Okay. The issue with Alabaster Box is that um, any soul hearts I pick up until it's filled go directly to the box. There's no option to like, okay, I want this one for myself. The only way to do that is to have another active to switch out, which we don't have here. Um, give us some money. Yes, yes, okay. There's one soul heart towards the box. That is good, that is good. So we need five more soul hearts. We're gonna keep our eyes peeled for marked rocks. Um, anything that would give us soul hearts, some cards perhaps, that could be hierophants. Whatever the case may be, we're gonna keep our eyes peeled for it. Let's see. Okay. I'm also checking for secret rooms. Before I send it right there, we're gonna make sure. Okay, it can be here. We also got ourselves a fun penny, which apparently is also widely known as a cardio penny or a cardio coin. So I'm gonna zoom, zoom, zoom around and see how much money we get from it first and foremost. And the angel deal, if we can get it this far, which it's looking pretty good unless we, like, take a bunch of damage, um, could also have some soul hearts for us. Let's increase it even more. Bye, Sanjay. We love you. Also, fun fact, we are well on our way to getting ourselves um, our beggars soon, hopefully, for on stream. Um, and while we're sitting here, as, as you guys know, I try not to start off my videos anymore with my intro, but um, if you like the concept you're seeing so far and you're new to the channel, feel free to go check me out on Twitch if you like live content. If not, and you just prefer the YouTube, um, I am posting Eden Streak videos twice a week. I'm aiming for every... Um, Sunday and Wednesday. Sometimes I'm late, but they do end up going up, I promise. That has been a thing 
only recently now, actually, the two Eden Street videos a week is a new thing I'm doing. I just did the math in my head and I was like, I think there's like 56 weeks in a year, right? And that's not that high of a streak to get to <laughs> if I'm only uploading once a week. So I figure we at least try and double that if we can. Alright. We're gonna fight this boss. Also, we just picked up Belly Jelly or Jelly Belly. I can't remember which one it was exactly. But it's really good. It has a chance to just bounce damage off of you and it's super cool. Um, okay. Not the most exciting chest in the world, but that's okay. Alright, we're going to use Soul of Eve. Soul of Eve summons a bunch of birds to help us with our fight. Which is good because we are way too slow for that shit. Okay. This is really good. We have no flies, but we can take this. So there's a soul heart. And we're gonna take Wafer. Wafer pretty much secures our win, in my personal opinion. We're gonna bomb all of these fires as well. For soul hearts. See, Belly Jelly just bounced one of those tears off of us, which was amazing. Alright, we're gonna bomb you. Come on, baby, and we're gonna bomb you. Come on, baby. Damn it. Okay. Well, we're gonna go finish full clearing now. Uh, I know you guys are like, well, what more could you possibly get? There's, you know, you found both secret rooms, blah, 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 blah. And while that may be true, we could still find some marked rocks out here. Ooh, that seems like a good, a good investment. <gasps> Thank you, Luckfoot. Little chest could give us soul hearts. Come on. <gasps> What's the last one? Is that Spoonbender? You guys, is that Spoonbender? <gasps> it is! This is so good! We got a bunch of money back! Thank you, Luckfoot! I'm never underestimating Luckfoot again, ever. Like, ever. I was gonna bring Petrified Poop with us um, for more money, but I think the damage is gonna be the winner here. And now we have Homing, which is so nice. We're not gonna miss our shots. Homing with Cricket's body is just awesome. Okay, okay, hold on. Hold the phone, what are you? Shot speed up, I'll take it. We're gonna take this trinket to see if we can get a soul heart or two from those poops. That is what we're gonna do. That is what we're gonna do. We're gonna milk every little bit of, from this floor as we can because we want to fill this alabaster box. All right, so there's some money. There's some more money. Some red hearts. One soul heart? Nah, but another cardio coin? We'll take it, we'll take it. You never know when we'll find another machine to play out. Oh, that claw machine had just such good stuff. More tears, homing, little chest. Little chest homie, that's cool. That's cool. We don't need the extra damage right now, but we were, we are gonna take it with us when we leave. With the homing, it's basically our extra damage. I mean, realistically. All right, we could check the cursed room, but I'm gonna try and keep my angel deals alive. I really am, so. We're gonna hope for the best there. <laughs> Goodbye, petrified poop. We will see you another day. Ugh, oh, spoon bender. Spoon bender. So good. So good. Um, we'll take the death card. I can't remember exactly what the reverse death card does, but we'll for science it at some point. over here not really worth risking our soul hearts for yet we will come back to it though and we're gonna bomb for this hopefully we have a decent shop because we have money honey if one of these were like soul heart I take it 
This room used to annoy the f out of me, but I've gotten better at what you have to do. There we go. Just don't hesitate, and as long as you're fast enough, you'll be okay. I am not really all that fast enough, but I'm- it's fine. Get away from me! Okay. Power pill is good. We know we have power pill. That could be cool. What do you have for us? <gasps> A soul heart. Okay. Two more soul hearts. That's it. What are you? Queen of Hearts. This is good. We're gonna hold on to Queen of Hearts. Queen of Hearts can spawn, I think, up to like 23 hearts. Like, just red hearts. Um, I don't know if there's actually a chance for soul hearts. Maybe? I heard rumors that like, in the cathedral room where you would spawn hearts has a chance to, but I'm not going to confirm nor deny you that. If we find the secret room, that I'm speaking of, like the evil secret room, I will definitely give it a shot, but I don't want to like waste it otherwise. All right, what do we got, what do we got? Not greed, not creed. This is good. We're gonna take this and we're gonna take you and please have a soul heart. Please have a soul heart under here so we can take this mystery gift with us. No soul heart, but we could roll. Now, this is the Soul of Lazarus, and Soul of Lazarus is basically just like an insta revive. Soul Heart. Damn it. Well, this is all kind of garbo. I don't really need all of that. Another Soul of Lazarus. Go away. Now, this. This. I'm gonna take. I like Soul of Cain. And it's really likely that it's Soul off of here, of so we're just gonna use it. Oh, we're so good. So basically what we just did was we used Soul of Cain, which opens all red doors attached to a room. So yeah, so here we are. Oh. This is Esau Jr. So basically when you use this, you flip to an entirely new build which I'm not even gonna mess with right now. So we're just gonna leave that behind, but that's okay. Not every super secret is gonna be a winner, you know? Oh, I didn't even see them there. That's okay, we're gonna use this time that we're shielded to just slay these guys out a little bit. All right, we're good. <laughs> we're fine, we just need one more soul heart. Experimental treatment. All right, we'll take it, what do we get? Um, our range is absolutely atrocious, but everything else went up, so. And I think we lost a red heart container, but that's okay, that's okay. The good thing now is if we find two cents, we will have, um, a backup item in case we need to pick up soul hearts for ourselves. But at this point, if we find a soul heart, we're taking it because we'll be done with Alabaster Box. Now this is really good, I want that, that's a speed up and it slows down rooms. So, you got some money, you got two cents. We need what? Seven more cents? Yes, seven more cents. So let's go do this challenge room and hope for the best. This is Power Pill, can't forget about that. This is Soul of Blue Baby and it kind of just, I think it just spawns you some random poops or something, which is like not the most exciting thing. Stay away from me. Be gone, demon. Be gone, fox. Go away. I am a man of God. Ah. Alright, it didn't give me <laughs> anything worthwhile, but it's okay. I do not have the stats for this. But I do have the bombs for this. Give me a soul heart, baby. Give me a soul heart, baby. Give me that 10%. All right. I should have used Soul of Cain to help me find the secret rooms. That's okay. Even a Sin Heart will do. Ah! All right, we're good. Pain. Mm, 
Do you have a soul heart? No? Okay. Alright, what's this way? This is easy enough. You just kind of gotta go with the flow. Hug the corners. That's my advice for this room. Hug the corners that are safe. Hug the corners that are safe. Okay, it looks like we've got a decently sized necro, which is good, because hopefully we'll find one soul heart somewhere on the second map. And as soon as we have 19 cents, we are going... Oh, look at that. As soon as we have 19 cents, we're going back. What do you have? Oh, the boss is gonna be like right over here, huh? Not quite, almost. I would like an arcade or a blood donor machine or something. We've got lots of health and ways to pay out, like, health things. <gasps> Belly Jelly just saved us right there. Jelly Belly. Belly Jelly. Belly Jelly? Jelly Belly. I don't know. Oh. Oh. Money. Money. What are you? Puberty? We'll take puberty. Let's go back and get that speed up because I am feeling quite slow. Oh, nope. Thanks. All right, all right, all right. I'm gonna bomb here. Shoot for the star. Oh. <gasps> we've done it, ladies and gentlemen, we've done it. Ew, Lazrags. These are terrible. Whatever. Glyph of Balance will give us stuff we need, I guess. Once we're broke, it'll give us money. Lazrags is, you know, at least if we die, we'll come back in the same room or whatever, so I guess I can't complain. We are healthy though, which is the main thing. We're healthy, this is good. We're healthy, this is good. We're gonna take this and speed us the, the heck up. Cause we're so slow. What do you have? Angel deal chance and two cents. I'll take it, I'll take it, all right. We will actually take this now cause I think we're comfortable enough to try it out. So. Why don't I have tears? Okay. I don't know why I don't have tears. This is terrible. Oh! We had kidney stone! This actually isn't bad. And we have flight? Okay! Alright! Okay! We just gotta not die, that's all. I guess we'll give you this. So now we know what build this guy has. He actually has a pretty banging build. And he has Cancer, Trisag, and Sacred Heart. We're gonna switch back though. We're gonna switch back. That's cool, that's cool though. It, it's not too bad. Oh, we hate this guy. I'm so glad we didn't come in here with like our half health, half an ass. Three sin hearts, yeah, no. Ew, does this make the little dude come with us? He shoots our tears? That's actually not bad. That's not bad. But is it better than the teeth shot? I don't think it is, because we, we need the damage, man. We need the damage. All right, let's take that just to be, oh, we're gonna lose half a soul heart. That's okay. Uh, you can't have the secret room. You can't have the super secret room. You could potentially have the super secret room. You don't have the super secret room, do you? That's what it's telling me. Do you have the secret room? You do. What's in here? Oh, it's Creed. Hi, Creed. Money. Thank you, Creed. Ooh, can we get enough money for... No. For... No. Ah, we'll go in here since we're gonna lose this anyway. We need two cents to be able to take that gift with us. Um. We'd have to find the super secret. 
hope that it's got a blood donor in it. I guess. Let's see. You cannot have. Well, yeah, you cannot have. You could have. You. Oh, we don't have any more bombs. Never mind. We tried. We really don't need the mystery gift, though. We didn't get the deal. It'd be nice for next deal, whenever we get it, but wait a minute, wait a minute. We need two cents. Two cents. One cent? <gasps> Two cents! Oh man, we are just. You guys. Where is this luck when I'm like doing unlocks and streaming? <laughs> That's what I want to know. Where is my luck for that? But it's fine. And now I know a lot of you are screaming, just use it in the secret room. No thanks. No thanks. I'm okay. I'm okay though. Thank you. Thank you though. I do appreciate <laughs> the thought and the advice, but I only ever get sh shit when I use the mystery gift in the secret room. Like, genuinely, just get garbage. So. Um. Um. Okay. Okay. Alright. So. I have figured out the question for you guys today. What is your favorite secret room pool item? It can be old, it can be new. Um, no, it cannot be rock bottom because this has to be a standalone item. Like without any other synergies, what is your favorite secret room item? R key is kind of a cop out too. So no R key, okay? No R key and no. No Arky and no. No Arky and no Rock Bottom. Mine is Bin Jeter. I love Bin Jeter. Bin Jeter can help you turn any run, you know, into a winner. It gives you health. It does slow you down, but your stats are worth it. Also, be sure to let me know that guess what? We just got Bookworm, so that is another 5,000 sweet tarts for anyone who mentions this in the chat. I mark it down in my notepad so I remember exactly what it is that you guys can redeem it for. Give me a... Oh, a chest inside of a chest? More money? I'm not going to cry about money because we still have a chance at a cool shop, which is going to have that cool little, you know, drop a down box. Drop down box? No. Membership card? membership card. <laughs> Words are difficult, but it's okay. Beautiful. Alright, we are going to take this with us. We're not going to open that room yet, just in case our shop has options. Mm, it's, I don't think I'd waste the money on options at this point in time, so. Let's just see, what do we got? <gasps> it's a rainbow baby! Look at how cute they are! So cute, so cute. All right, let's get a room full of a bunch of little, I mean, I guess, but not exactly what I was hoping. I mean, it's a decent amount. No, we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait. Sorry for all my ramblings, but we're gonna wait for this room. Oh, but this room has like nobody. I got you baited so hard. Look at that. There's like nobody in here to, there was two people in here for us to kill. If you guys are wondering what I'm doing, it's because this book will give you bones and bony friends uh, based on how many enemies you kill in said room before using it. You cannot walk out and come back. That doesn't work. <gasps> no, the troll bomb blew up my little buddy. Sad. I guess this one will have to do. Normally I like to wait for even more than that, but it's okay. Oh my gosh! We have a shop. What's down here? Let's see what's down here. Diplopia? Diplopia, you say? A little juicy little diplopia? None of these are really worth diploing, though. It's like my thing. You know? The angel deal could be worth diploing. That is a fact. So let's find the fool card. 
and well I guess we have to see if we can even get the money first <laughs> let's see if we can even get the money first come on open your ugly face nice we stay healthy here we stay healthy here chat who is it is that a bony hand it is not. They are mom's fleshy, gross, disgusting hands that need a manicure. Ooh. Honestly, Cricket Lake is pretty good. It spawns random locusts here and there. Which is, like, absolutely amazing. Let's see what we can do here. It's IV bag? Gross. Well, there's the money that we needed. Honestly, we can do even more money than that. Let's see. Look at how many red hearts we got! We're gonna save some hearts so that we can use the IV bag to get into the curse room. We got a cardio penny? Look at all this money. Has the same energy as look at all those chickens. Okay, cool. We bomb you for a little extra cashola. There we go. We grab you and we see what the rest of the floor holds before we just full send to the boss fight. We still need to find the skull. That is going to give us full card. Found it. Found it. Beautiful. Amazing. We love to see it. Very poggers. Alright. Let's go get the Plopia. And hopefully we get an awesome angel deal. Even if we don't get an angel deal and we get a devil deal, that's okay. Because we can diplo the devil deal and take the devil items, you know? If we, we have the money, so we're gonna take that other trinket as well to give us shops in the womb, only because we have this amazing item called membership card, that little gold card we picked up a few floors back, and that's gonna, you know, that alone makes shops worth it. Alright. Don't you step on my homies, how dare. How dare. See, look at the, look at the locusts that spawn. Flies from the... The horseman. Like the seven seals flies. So good. So worth. And I forgot that we have Leech. We should have just left our red hearts empty, to be honest. Because look at Leech doing work. hoping this is something better. It's not, though. We'll take him, though. Alright. What do we use? Diplo on. The gift, maybe? The gift? Use Diplo on the gift. Where even is the gift? Mm. Well, we're gonna buy this. We're gonna keep this. We are going to, we don't need the soul hearts. We are gonna go back to the library. And I guess Diplo the books? I don't, it seems like such a waste of a Diplo. But I mean, it's Diploing the books and the gift, so. And we'll open you here. And that's great. We'll touch you and we'll touch you and blah blah blah. And then 
that's a pretty good book too. It increases our deal protection and its health regen, but it's still really not that great. So I think we're gonna take Book of the Dead with us. I was kind of hoping for Book of Virtues. Thought that could be fun. That's okay. We're still gonna check the curse room. You guys are like, you could have taken the gift in case of another angel deal. Which is true, but I don't really care that much. Like, my level of caring for that is, is extremely low. Extremely low. Alright, but the run's starting to get a little long, so my apologies. My apologies, we're not gonna even go to the curse room, but I am going to make a bunch of money from myself real quick. Alright. Because Leech is going to continue to fill it up for us. And we'll come get these hearts right here just because they're nearby. There we go. Okay. Just so we have the money. It's it's honestly really tempting to take IV bag. We're going to take IV bag. Heck it. We'll get free um, deals. Not deals, but free curse rooms. Which is nice. So, come on. Darn. All right, let's go. And it stayed open. What a shame. What you got in here? Nothing. Well, we'll fight you for more angel deal chance. Let's go. That was worth. All right. So worth it. Alright. Aw oh, man, it's an XL floor. That's so sad. That's so sad. It's okay. Ooh, a golden bomb, you say? Well, that's rather nice. We need one more heart container to be able to get in and out of that room for free. So. Or a power pill. Power pill also works. There we go. <gasps> a soul of Lilith, you say. Soul of Lilith spawns you a perfect soul little homie. Lilith. They are free. Um, we're gonna do this. There we go. That's how you get in and out of curse rooms without getting rid of your soul hearts. You have IB bag. IB bag. It's honestly so great for that. It's a nice little trick I've learned. Use the iframes from the IB bag. Oh, I forgot we have wafer. So it's only doing half heart damage. I was expecting it to do whole heart damage, but I forgot we got wafer. Wafer is also amazing. Look at all this health. Look at all this health. A sacrifice room, you say. That could be a potentially a potential thing. So we'll keep that in mind. We'll actually save some health. Ooh, we've got keys. Oh, poop. It's the health up. We're gonna leave that there for now. We don't really need it. Gertie's gonna just bounce around the screen like a madman and do his thing. More health. Oh, I forgot we have Glyph of Balance, so it's gonna give us red hearts until um, we're full of red health. So now it should start dropping like, I don't know, probably bombs since that's what we have the least of. That's how Glyph of Balance works. It gives you what you need most. Hematomesis! Hemma to Mises. That was amazing. That was actually amazing. How was I to know that that would be a hematopsis? Sorry. Yeah, give me that sin heart back. If we get the angel deal, there's no reason for us to play out the sacrifice room, really. Unless we need an absolute massive amount of money, which we really shouldn't. 
Alright. Hemma to Basis! Didn't even know that that's like how that was said. I was almost certain it was hematemesis. We have a rainbow poop back here, by the way. after this, which is nice. Tempted to bomb all the way through the cathedral just so we can wrap this up and try and get done within an hour's time. Our range is still very bad, like actually. I forgot what that was. Little do you know. Sorry. That song stuck in my head. Like, painfully so, in fact. No, you're not supposed to hit me. Rude. This is just me being lazy here, by the way. And not wanting to care about them attacking. We have Lazarax, we do come back. Where is our shop? Give unto me the shop of my dreams. These guys don't stay up long enough for my explosive to do anything. Heartbreaking. World shattering. World star. No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, so favorite secret room item that is not Rock Bottom or Arky, because I feel like those are just cop outs. And your reason why, if you don't mind sharing. I'm curious to see what other people think. Mine is 100% and unapologetically, um, binge eater. Any run, even if you get all shitty active items, becomes a decent enough run. Ooh, luck up. Luck up. Explosive diarrhea. Experimental pills, a speed up. Balls of steel, beautiful, and two power pills. All right, what do we got? Pog, not Creed. What do we got down here? Give us a reroll machine. Give us a reroll machine. No reroll machine. Sad, sad, sad. Are you a Perthra? You're a blank room. Interesting. I'm going to take Black Candle and remove from us the curse. And this was indeed a Perthra. We'll take the poop bucket. Why not? There's no reason not to. And I think it gave us exact, not, well, more than exactly enough, I suppose. Let's go. Ooh, wait, we bombed the keeper here. We'll bomb the ugly keeper, not our cute little bean keeper. Because why would we want to bomb our little bean keeper? Alright. Quick. I mean, I guess we can pick up all of these red hearts. I guess. I mean, I don't really know why not. On our way to the boss fight. Keep an eye out for my new single. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Ooh, I hate this guy. Ooh, I hate this guy. Ooh, he's disgusting. Oh, I hate him. Hate, hate, hate. Hate, hate, hate him. Hate him so much. I hate him. Hate him. Put your stupid head down. Yeah. Explode. Nice. Stapler. We needed that damage bad, bad. So, yeah. <laughs> That's good. Alright. 
Alright, come on. No deal, sadness. It's no deal, but that's okay. We're gonna go up, 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 and then speed run through the cathedral. Speed run, speed run. Meow. Oh, pain. That spider almost got me. There we go. The woof woof worm is not ideal. Oy, 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 oy. Yes, leech. What's in here? Ooh, we always check these. We actually, actually, this is this is life saving. This range is god tier. And um, stopwatch is amazing. That made that fight so much easier. It could have been so much harder than it was. Take this guy? Can you not do that? It's fine. It's fine. This is not fine. Goodbye. Alright. We're trying to zoom zoom through the room rooms, but that's it's just, you know, not in the cards at the moment. If we discover we're going the wrong way again, we will just, you know bomb out of it. But for now we're gonna, you know. Ah. Teleport. Teleport. <gasps> we'll take it. Ah. This just means it'll drop more solely hearts. I don't know how that actually works though. Well, we'll take that. I'm not sure how that actually works with um with something else messing with our drops. With Glyph of Balance. Maybe when it drops red hearts, it's a chance to be soul hearts? I do not know. There are also ways to cheese Glyph of Balance, but that's not our, you know, like, place to show you how to cheese it. Because it's, it's actually kind of a bitch, if I'm gonna be honest. It's not really that big of a deal, but we can't do it right now anyway because we have far too many empty red heart containers. To give you the gist of it, if you have less than four red heart containers, less than five red heart containers. So if you have four red heart containers or less, so I was right, okay. Um. And then, are you a Perthro? It's a blank room. Let's see. And then you leave yourself at like X amount of hearts. Like you leave yourself with full red heart containers, but don't pick up any soul hearts. Or as long as you only have four hearts, but all of the red containers, like they have to be full. You can have one soul heart on top of it. Let's say you have three red hearts and one soul heart. And then you keep clearing rooms. The game will drop you soul hearts. That's how I wanted to say it. The game will drop you soul hearts. Um, and you just leave them on the floor until the end of the floor or until you need another soul heart to protect your deal. And then you go and you pick them up. It's a really great way to farm health should you need it we don't have flight <laughs> we don't have flight uh, i don't like this let me leave let me leave hopefully this is the way it is indeed the way i hope that explanation was okay that's what i meant by like i really wasn't gonna try and take the time to explain it but hope you can understand. If not, I'm sorry. I am so sorry. This is why we love tear effects. 
people sleep on explosive, oh man. Let's go! We're gonna use the blank room once we open these chests. If we see anything we don't like, we can try and either purr through them or black room them. We're gonna take this, we're not gonna take this, we're not gonna take any of these. You know what? I will take a mapping. Mapping is nice. I'm pretty sure that um, laser item is the one that replaces your tears, and I don't want to do that, so we're not going to be replacing our tears. Look, more heals from kills. And a little bit of damage. Okay, magic mush. We're summoning the magic mush. Magic mush, the magic mush. We're summoning the magic mush. Sad. Relax. Tears up, we'll take it. Tears up, we'll take it. Balls of steel, we could have saved it. That's fine. Alright, we're just gonna go straight for the boss fight. Uh, we're gonna be just a little longer than an hour into the run. If we had paused when we talked about certain conversations, discussed certain things, we'd be fine right now. But, you know, chatty Kathy over here. And it's a heart. You don't need the heart, friend. We'll check the secret room. Okay. We'll check the secret room. Nope. Okay. It was worth checking. You never know. If we had found an R key, I'd probably do like a part two of this video. It wouldn't count as another run, but it'd be fun. Kind of just shredding, actually. Ooh, yep. And you are, yep. And we are, yep. Winning. What are we doing? We're winning. This guy can't jump away from our explosive OTs. Boom, boom, boom. We should only be a little bit over like an hour as far as the in-game timer goes. But thank you guys so much for watching. I always appreciate, like, I see the views like growing as I continue to be persistent and I just want y'all to know I appreciate it. You're awesome. Um, taking time out of your day to watch my videos when I don't find them that entertaining. I try to be as good as I can with them, but you know, we all have flaws that we see in ourselves, and mine is just, I don't see myself as entertaining, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, don't forget, feel free to answer that question. What is your favorite secret item room? You are not allowed to say our key. You are not allowed to say rock bottom. Standalone secret room item that is your favorite. Sorry, I was popping bubble wrap. You know, nervous habits. But, um, thank you again. And feel free to check me out live on Twitch. Um, some weeks are weirder than others, so Discord is the best way to know when to keep an eye on those things. But... Normally, on a normal week, Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Monday is usually 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time because, you know, the weekend. Um, I take Wednesdays off. Saturdays are my makeup days if I take an additional day other than Wednesday off. Um, so, yeah. Thanks for watching. And until next time, stay sweet, YouTube. Later.